Hello. Often on these extremely mountainous and curvy roads, not only will you be able to stop every once in a while on a small little, I don't know, embankment, and just enjoy the view for a few minutes and take a picture of just the most beautiful scene you've ever seen, and then you go a few kilometers, and you see another beautiful scene and you're like, you want to stop like every single time and take a picture, but it would take you about, you know, 10,000 years to get through Baja if you did that, right? But the main purpose for this movie is this right here. Often you will see these, especially on a really, really curvy road. And this is a memoriam to whoever died here. I'm guessing they probably drove right off the road on one of these curvy areas that those vehicles are coming around. Maybe they were going a little too fast. Maybe it was dark. Maybe they got hit by a drunk driver. Who the fuck knows, right? But anyways, look, you drive, you're right near the highway, then all of a sudden, you're in the fucking ocean. Or it's like a really deep crevice or something like that, and there's a whole bunch of rocks at the bottom, but... I mean, like, how fucking frightening would it be in that second, or maybe even half a second, flying right off the fucking cliff? And you know what? Like, I'm actually glad that these memoriams are here. Because every few kilometers, you're fucking reminded that if you don't pay attention, you're fucking dead. And look, like, whoever built this obviously put a lot of attention into it. Obviously put a lot of care into it. Because look, there's candles. I can see inside there's candles burning in there right now. And there's a door. You can open it up and put a candle in there. Like, look at all the fucking candles that are in there. Uh, it's locked, so. But look, there's like fresh flowers in there. Candles burning. There's even a little note in there. More flesh, fresh flowers in the corner over there. <laughs> matches sitting on the window. A whole bunch of pictures on the walls and some writing on the walls. But yeah, like, these memorials aren't always so, like, huge, so grandiose as they, as my dumb ass would say. But yeah, like, sometimes they're really small. You know, they just have a little light on them, a little solar light, like... Or sometimes it's just a cross on a... on a windy road, maybe by a... maybe by one of those signs, maybe by a railing over there. Sometimes the railings aren't even fixed, and you can tell that, you know, somebody recently just went right off the railing, and then there's like a cross right where the railing is broken. But anyways, I don't want to drone on and on and on about death, but honestly, I'm glad that these, these things are here. Because, you know, if I'm ever feeling tired or really tired or just out of it and I'm like, oh, I see one of these memorials, I'm like, oh, yeah. <laughs> Why be a dumbass, you know? Why end up dead? Oh, well. That's enough of my morbid ass. See you later.